make no mistake about it, when I jumped out here, I knew I would be a target. And because I knew the history of Cronus, Zeus, and scripture, I also expected my sons to be the first to attack me. Because they are predictable, they did just that. The things I had to say are nothing compared to what is said on YouTube. So why am I attacked? Two reasons. One, because I am the father and they following scripture. Two, because the folks on YouTube are dangerous and will strike back. This may get deeper on my webpage, striking at the soul of the demon that controls this world and the way it functions and people should leave my page is not to be offended. Then again, I may do the leaving of my page is not to offend and sit back and watch <laughs> as well as pray. The powers that be are running this game. I love God just as you love Jesus, Buddha, and any of the deities. The difference is I don't have to worship to be loved by God. And do not have to worship to be loved by God. In fact, you don't even have to believe in God. Belief is okay. I'm getting wrong though. Belief is okay. Knowing is better. By the way, faith has nothing to do with religion. And faith is the physics of God. It's part of the physics, that is. Faith is important. The atheists, for example, has less crime in their world get buried like you do, have just as much money as you do. And they survive kidney and liver transplants as you do. Where you thank God for getting out of a burning car they also are thankful, they just don't be thanking God. I do thank God. And that is the purpose of this song that I'm about to play. However, I know that I don't have to. But that is the way I was raised. That's the way I was brought up. Furthermore, if there is a lie in the game that we are playing, you need to deal with it or face revelations. No, the world will never end. It will only end as you know it. And disaster will be felt until you get it right. You are the dinosaurs 
in refined order. They discovered a wolf. I don't remember how old they said that wolf was. They had a picture of him. It looked like the wolves of today, but it was at least a million years ago. See, this thing is recycling over and over again. And we have improved since the dinosaur era, but the suffering and destruction will continue. World after world, eternity after eternity, until you get it right. Once you get it right, then you have completed God's work and the whole world will be a happy paradise. Now, let me tell you these calm trails, because these storms is not a joke. Climate change is real. But as I said, the world won't end. It's just going to change. I used to think that when they were spraying those chemicals in the air, and they call them contrails, 99% of you don't even look up. This is amazing. You live in a world where the sky up there and you don't look up. You know, you look down at the ground. Anyway, I used to think those contrails and a lot of people, uh, conspiracist type people, they said that the contrails were there to kill us, spray chemicals on us and we slowly die of cancer. I know I'm not against that, but I believe that they're really doing the contrails to blanket the sky, to prevent the sun from burning you up. I believe they're controlling the atmosphere. They messed it up, and now they're trying to control it. And then I tell them, you, first of all, you panic. So, next spring, first of all, look up, and you'll see all of them calm trails. You can keep thinking it's a jet plane from the airport if you want to, but You'll see them, and a couple days later, the sky will be blanketed with a blanket of clouds. And the sun will not be able to come through. And of course, there'll be a lot of rain, too. That will continue until at least the beginning of July. Then they're going to let you have some summer. Because if they didn't, then you would know something's up. But when they stop the calm trails so that the sun comes out, that sun will be so hot, you won't be, high, be able to walk. When you get in your cars, you're going to be grabbing the, 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 the steering wheel and it's going to be hot. Because that's what it is now. I ain't never lied to you, so you tell me if that's a lie. And when they give you that summer, it's going to be hot, but it's also going to be burning up the leaves on the trees. So when you look at the leaves on the trees, once they start allowing you to think that you, you have some having summer now, just take a look at the leaves on the trees. And, and, and you probably have. Now, of course, there are always going to be the, the issues, which I don't ever really get into, is what can you do about all of this? But one thing, you got to first stop eating that meat. I'm telling you, okay, what you think about how healthy you are. Are you paying attention to what happens when you get older or people that are older? And nobody on this earth yet died of natural causes. Everyone's dying of some form of malfunction in the body. Literal gone on dialysis. The preacher be lying up to you and you and you know he lying. He sit up there and look at you and say, he or she died in peace. No, they didn't. They were on dialysis, half kidneys, cancer like. And they got tired of all that stuff, to tell you the truth. And so when they died, yeah, I guess when you die, you are peaceful, but you weren't peaceful until the death existed, came. And some people be loaded with drugs during that time. And this is everybody, you know. 
So don't, you're taking it as it's the way it's supposed to be. No, it's not. Anyway, I love you, and I'm not against you. Peace out. Concept came to me to make this album, you know, it was just about me just putting together some tracks and trying to make people feel the vibe that I was coming on. You know, little did I know that it'd be a spiritual journey for me. Then it turned into the awake. Then it hit me that the lyrics that I pick and choose for this album could be used for a breakthrough or a breakdown. So you gotta be careful because the power of life and death is in the tongue. So if you sit here and receive this, I hope you ain't feel. Was it in your will? Like when you gave me that job that I didn't take Or when I hooked up with that woman I wasn't supposed to date And when you told me come here and I moved far Already had a ride, didn't need a car And then they repossessed it You know I've been tested Been through these awesome lessons I put my head on your chest And you still blessed it There's no way to be paid Hope I'm caught up in your rapture when you come back on that day But you a bug, tired of being a thug Greet all my peace with hugs I asked you what you would do, and you said show him love It ain't as hard as you think it could be I'm giving you what he's giving me Thank you for giving me life I already know there's gonna be times when I disappoint you So I pray that you keep me and my loved ones Under your everlasting, ever-loving grace and mercy Please allow me to keep my focus As I travel the road to my already predetermined date with destiny I'm leaning on your promises Thank you for all the talents and the gifts that you have breathed into me Thank you. 